Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, Mr. Four K Upscaler. So, lately I've been having trouble with a 3090 Ti N3090 from Zotac, which was uh, given to me to test till August uh, 11th and 17th. Uh, both Zotac and EVGA 3090s flight simulator doesn't work. And I tried everything. I tried reinstalling, installing the game. I tried reinstalling the uh, Xbox app. I tried every possible thing. Nothing seems to work. It simply won't load the game. So, I'm going to prove to you that 3090s GPUs are not compatible with Flight Simulator. And I don't know why not many are talking about this. Maybe because not many people have 3090 because they're so darn expensive. Uh, but you'll see with a 3080, this is my 3080, that it's mine. And 3070 also that it's mine. I have like two GPUs I own. 3080, this one, by Zotac. And 3070 by PNY, which you have seen. And you will see once I install this 3080, the flight simulator will work just fine. So let's go ahead. Let's swipe uh, 3080 into my PC. And let's remove 3090 Ti. And you'll see that uh, 3080 will work just fine with a flight simulator that's what i'm trying to do with this video maybe bring this to your attention because not many people are talking about this maybe a sobo will see this video maybe nvidia evga will see this video uh in zotac and uh maybe they'll talk to a sobo and find out what's going on so anyway let's go ahead let's do this let me uh put a 3080 inside and let's fight it out All right, so there it is. I got the uh, 3080 installed from Zotac. This is my card. 3080. We're going to fire up the uh, flight simulator, and you're going to see that 3080 works. And 3070 works. Just 3090 Ultra and 3090 Ti. So 3090 cards don't work with flight simulator. I'm going to prove that point. Let's go ahead, let's uh, fire up the flight simulator and you're going to see it. Alright, so here we go, moment of truth. So there's 3080, Zotac lights up. One of the things I like about the Zotac, they really have an amazing lighting, uh, especially with a 3090. Uh, Ti Ultra and 3090. Uh, you've seen 3090, the one that I that I did. It lights up the entire. By the way, 3090 is the biggest card. Like if, from Zotac, Zotac has the biggest card. It goes up to 13 and a half inches. And if you get a 3090 Ti, it goes up to 14 inches. It's like the biggest uh, GPU. So anyway, let's see if the flight simulator is working. And you're gonna see that on 3080, it works. And 39, uh, 3070. So anything. Below 3090, it's going to work. 3080, 3070, 3060. But once you go up to 3090, 3090 Ti, it doesn't work. For some reason, uh, it's not compatible with a 3090 and 3090 Ti. So let's go ahead. Let's boot up the game. All right, so here we are. I'm going to go ahead and uh, go to my Windows. All right, so let's uh, start Flight Simulator. There we go, let's see if it works. Alright, there it is right there. And uh, you will see that it will work. 100%. And I'm surprised that not many people are talking about this. Um, quite honestly. Because I was really expecting that 3090 would be running Flight Simulator. Uh, it was very shocking when I find out that it doesn't work. And what's even more shocking that no one's talking about it. Like, you don't see Jay-Z Two Cents talk about it. You don't see other people talk about it. You don't see these big YouTubers talking about it. I'm probably the only guy on the YouTube 
so you should share this video uh to break the news like what's up with a 3090 not supporting a uh, flight simulator like come on because i don't want you guys to go ahead and buy a 3090 for a flight simulator then you find out it doesn't work um because i looked around the youtube no one's talking about it i'm like the only guy like this is probably the only the first video you're gonna see so i hope you guys will share this video so this is 3080 let's see and i guarantee you it's gonna work let's continue safe mode I guarantee you it's going to work with a 3080. I guarantee you. And if it doesn't work, well, then there's definitely something wrong uh, with my PC. Then there's definitely something wrong uh, with my Windows. I might have to reinstall my Windows or something. Clean slate from the beginning. Delete everything. Start from the beginning. Um... But we'll see. We'll find out. I'm moving to the safe mode, so we'll see what happens. The reason I say that that this is the reason why I think is the GPU because ever since I installed the 3090 from Zotac, Flight Simulator didn't work, and then I installed the 3090 Ti forward to Win 3. It didn't work. But 3070 worked just fine. 3080 worked just fine. Alright, let's see. I'm not going to edit this video. I want you to see like exactly as it's loading up and everything. I don't want you to think that I'm manipulating this video or something. It's still loading. And I selected the safe mode so we can uh, move in into the safe mode. All right, let's see what happens. God damn, it's slowed so long, man. This flight simulator has been nothing but a disaster, man. For two and a half years, man. Disaster. And this annoying music that they play in the background. Ugh. You noticed how a flight simulator only has three stars. There's a reason for that. I know what I'm talking about, man. Since 2020, man, I've been dealing with a flight simulator. And uh, half-baked ha half experience, man. Half-baked experience. See? It works. See? It works. So I was right. I was right. The 3090 GPUs, for some reason, can't support flight simulator they're not compatible with a flight simulator why that is i don't know uh, listen i hope you guys will share this video i hope you will uh tell everyone about this because i think it's uh ridiculous i already contacted evga i already contacted uh, contacted zotac so both evga and zotac i sent them an email i said hey guys i tested uh your both of your gpus and uh flight simulator is not working and i said i know it's your gpus because when i switch back to 3080 and 3070 uh even 2060 it works just fine but every time i move on to 3090 zotac and 3090 ti evga forward to win 3 black edition uh it won't load so Please share this video. I'm really shocked that no one's talking about this. That no one's mentioning this. Uh, I'm probably the only video right now. And it will take a while for this video to be out there. So I need, I need you to share this video. I need you to let Asobo know. I think Asobo should know about this. 
both Asobo and Nvidia, they need to know what's going on here. And, and I think if you're somebody who has Flight Simulator and you're thinking about upgrading the 3090, do not, I repeat, do not upgrade the 3090. You won't be able to play Flight Simulator. So do yourself a favor, watch this video, and I want you guys to share this video, not for me, but for people out there, for NVIDIA, so that way they know for both Asobo and NVIDIA. I want Asobo and NVIDIA to see this video. So maybe Asobo can contact NVIDIA and find out what's going on with a 3090. Okay, so thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Take care.